Students at one local school got an up close and unique look at how trash affects whales and other marine life. First alert meteorologist Pierce Legion crawled into the belly of the whale and has more. Students at Greene County Middle School crawled inside a life-size 58-foot inflatable whale to learn how trash affects marine life. Watson the Whale travels to schools across the coastal Carolinas throughout the school year. It's part of an outreach program through UNCW's Marine Quest. Crawling inside the belly of a whale may be a fun experience, but it's also a great interactive learning tool about how trash affects marine life. Other animals like our whales are eating them, they're ingesting them, they're getting caught in it. So we talk about ingestion, which is one main consequence, and entanglement. Those are the two main issues that we have with our animals. Trash can make its way into the ocean from anywhere, even hundreds of miles away. The program stresses the impact each piece of misplaced trash can have on the ecosystem. When that bag flies out of the car accidentally or when that, that trash can overflows and that trash goes somewhere else, um, that it's going to be making its way to affect others and to affect organisms that live off of our coast. And the students are all ears. It's not good for people to throw away trash. Like We need to recycle and like we got to think about the whales and like the other animals that's in the ocean. Watson will continue traveling across the area through August. In Snow Hill, meteorologist Pierce Legion, not on your side. Marine Quest received a grant from NOAA to cover the program through August. Organizers hope to continue taking Watson to schools for many years to come.